TextBroker makes it possible for clients to order content using a CSV file. This is a quick and easy way to easily place a large number of orders at the same time without having to create a new order for each individual project. Creating a CSV file to place your orders can be done with any spreadsheet application, though it's best done using OpenOffice. The table format is ideal for setting important parameters to your order. Simply input the correct information and values into the right columns. You will want to provide the following information in your CSV file. In the column A, clarify the titles for your orders. Given that the order title is the first thing an author sees when they view your order, it's important to choose a helpful and interesting title. Determine the minimum and maximum amount of words your content should contain under columns B and C. For column D, state which star level you'd like, either 2, 3, 4, or 5 stars. If you prefer to place a team order, please enter 20 here. The CSV function is currently not available for placing direct orders. Under column E, indicate how many days the author has to work on your order once they have accepted writing it. Choose which categories your orders belong to in column F. Column G should include instructions that authors will see. State how you need your content completed, how it should be structured, and what the author should focus on. View our tutorial on instructions for the latest tips. In columns H, I, and J, you can specify what keywords should be included and the minimum and maximum number of times that they can be used within your content. If you have numerous keywords for an article, separate them with a comma. Under columns K and L, decide if you'd like plurals, inflections, and connecting words allowed in your content, which allow the author to use short connecting words or to grammatically alter the keyword so that it reads correctly in the flow of the article. This often considerably improves the overall flow of an article. To activate the option, put a number 1 in the column. Caution: If you've created your file using the TextBroker example template, don't forget to delete the extra descriptions and instructions from the table. Remember to save your file as a CSV, otherwise it won't be recognized by the system. Be sure to set the list separator to semicolon and text delimiter to quotation marks. You'll find all explanations on the CSV files in the PDF to download when you click the button CSV Files Detail. Once you've created your CSV file, you can upload it in the Order Management Dashboard. Here, you can decide if you'd prefer to place the orders as an open order or as a team order. Then, just click on Import via CSV to upload a file from your hard drive, choose the right file by clicking on the button Choose File. Choose the project for your orders, and then on Continue to upload the file. Once the upload has been successfully completed, TextBroker will make your orders available to the authors as a team order or an open order. Just as with any other orders you've created, the briefing form is exactly the same, and you'll be able to make changes to your order in the same way as any other.